Did you know that the Pacific Ocean is so vast that it is greater than the total land area of the entire world? Yes, you heard that right. The Pacific Ocean, a seemingly endless expanse of water that stretches as far as the eye can see, is indeed larger than all of the Earth's land combined. Now let's take a moment to wrap our heads around that. We are talking about an ocean so expansive that it covers more than 63 million square miles. That's enough to fit all seven continents and still have room to spare. Deeper than the highest mountain, Mount Everest, the Pacific Ocean's deepest point, the Mariana Trench, plunges down to a staggering depth of over seven miles. So, how did this colossal body of water come to be known as the Pacific Ocean? Well, it's quite the tale. The name Pacific comes from the Latin word Pacificus, which means peaceful. It was named by the Portuguese explorer Ferdinand Magellan, who sailed the ocean's tranquil waters during his expedition around the globe in the 16th century. Despite its serene name, the Pacific Ocean is anything but calm beneath its surface. Its waters, teeming with a diverse array of marine life, hold secrets that scientists and explorers are still trying to uncover. Its depths are home to some of the most intriguing and mysterious creatures, from the luminous anglerfish to the elusive giant squid. And it's not just the marine life that's fascinating, the Pacific Ocean's floor is a treasure trove of underwater mountains, deep sea vents, and even sunken islands. Despite our technological advancements, we've only just scratched the surface of what lies beneath these vast waters. The Pacific Ocean, with its size, depth, and uncharted mystery, is a testament to the unexplored and the unknown. It's a reminder that our planet, even in the 21st century, still holds secrets waiting to be discovered. Now brace yourself as we dive into the deep, dark, and unexplored mysteries of the Pacific Ocean. Imagine a city submerged under the Pacific Ocean with ancient pyramids and structures still intact. This is not a scene from a science fiction movie but a reality that continues to baffle scientists and researchers. The discovery of these underwater pyramids and structures in the Pacific Ocean is a topic that has stirred intrigue and excitement among historians, archaeologists, and adventure seekers alike. These underwater pyramids, strikingly similar to the Great Pyramids of Egypt, were discovered in the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean. They are a testament to the architectural prowess of an era long gone. The structures, despite being submerged for centuries, have remarkably stood the test of time, a testament to the skill of their creators. Theories abound about the origins of these underwater structures. Some researchers believe they were built by an ancient civilization that once thrived in the Pacific. These theories often point to the advanced construction techniques used, suggesting a level of knowledge and skill that rivals, if not surpasses, our own. This lost civilization, some suggest, could have been wiped out due to a catastrophic event, causing their cities to sink deep into the ocean. Others, however, argue that these structures could be the result of natural geological processes. They propose that over time, the relentless movement of tectonic plates and the constant erosion caused by ocean currents may have carved these structures out of the ocean floor. But this theory too has its critics who argue that nature is unlikely to create such symmetrical and organized structures. The debate continues with each new discovery adding another piece to the puzzle. One thing is certain though, these underwater pyramids and structures hold a wealth of information about our planet's past, waiting to be discovered. So we are left with a tantalizing question. Could these underwater pyramids be evidence of an ancient civilization that once thrived in the Pacific? As we delve deeper into the mysteries of the Pacific Ocean, we can only hope to uncover the truth behind these fascinating underwater pyramids. If you thought the Bermuda Triangle was eerie, wait until you hear about the Pacific's own version, the Devil's Sea. The Devil's Sea, also known as the Dragon's Triangle, holds its own share of dark tales and unsolved mysteries. Nestled off the coast of Japan, this sea has been the subject of countless legends, with stories passed down from generation to generation. The tales are chilling, ships vanishing without a trace, compasses spinning out of control, strange lights dancing on the water, and even tales of sea monsters lurking below the surface. One of the most infamous stories is that of the Japanese research vessel, Kayo Maru No. 5. In the mid-20th century, the ship set sail to investigate the Devil's Sea Mysteries, only to disappear itself taking everyone on board with it. Its wreckage was later found but the crew? They were never seen again. So, what's behind these eerie occurrences? Some suggest that the Devil's Sea is a portal to another dimension, a vortex that swallows up anything that dares to cross its path. 
Others believe in the existence of an underwater city, a lost civilization that somehow interferes with our world, causing these bizarre happenings. But of course, there are those who seek answers from science. Some scientists propose that the Devil's Sea is home to large deposits of methane hydrates. When these are disturbed, they can cause water to froth and bubble, reducing buoyancy and causing ships to sink. As for the disappearing aircraft, magnetic anomalies in the area could interfere with navigational equipment, leading them off course and into danger. Yet, despite these theories, the Devil's Sea remains shrouded in mystery. The numerous disappearances remain unexplained and the chilling tales continue to circulate, adding to the lore of this enigmatic part of the world. Is the Devil's Sea just a myth or is there a scientific explanation behind these strange occurrences? The truth, it seems, is as elusive as the sea itself. In the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean, there are islands that have mysteriously disappeared while others hold dark secrets. Let's embark on a journey to explore some of the enigmatic islands scattered across the Pacific. Islands that have vanished without a trace, and those that are shrouded in tales of curses and hauntings. First, let's navigate to the infamous Bermea Island. Once charted off the Yucatan Peninsula's coast, it's now nowhere to be found. Despite being featured on maps for centuries, it suddenly ceased to exist in the late 20th century. Expeditions have been launched, but none have managed to locate the elusive island. It's as if Bermea has been swallowed by the ocean's depths, leaving behind nothing but whispers of its existence. From a missing island we journey to an island that is all too real, yet drenched in dread. Welcome to Pavilia Island, also known as the Island of Ghosts. Nestled in the Venice Lagoon it's a place steeped in dark tales. Once a quarantine station for plague victims in the 14th century, it later served as a mental asylum. The island is said to be cursed, haunted by the spirits of those who perished there. Many claim to hear ghostly whispers and chilling screams emanating from its deserted buildings. Lastly, we set sail for Nan Madol, an ancient city off the coast of Pompeii. A marvel of engineering, it's often referred to as the Venice of the Pacific. However, it's not the city's architecture that's intriguing, but the mysteries it harbors. Local legends narrate that the city was built by sorcerers using levitation. To this day, the origins of Nan Madol and the people who built it remain an enigma, and there you have it. A quick voyage through the Pacific, unveiling islands that have slipped off the map, islands shrouded in eerie legends, and islands steeped in unsolved mysteries. These islands add another layer to the Pacific's rich tapestry of mysteries. Beneath the Pacific Ocean's surface, in its deepest, darkest corners, live creatures so enormous, they defy belief. This vast aquatic expanse is home to some of the most colossal beings on Earth, untouched by human exploration and thriving in the abyss. Let's begin our journey into the deep with the giant squid. This elusive tentacled titan can reach lengths of up to 43 feet, rivaling a four-story building. Its eyes, as big as dinner plates, are perfect for detecting the faintest glimmers of light in the pitch-black depths. Yet, Despite their enormous size, these behemoths are masters of camouflage, their bodies equipped with special cells that allow them to change color and blend into their surroundings, making them invisible to both prey and predators. Next, we dive deeper to meet the blue whale, the absolute monarch of the ocean. Stretching up to a hundred feet in length, they are the largest animals ever to have lived on our planet. Bigger than any dinosaur, their hearts alone can weigh as much as a small car. These gentle giants are known to feed on minuscule creatures called krill, consuming up to four tons in a single day. The blue whale's calls, the loudest of any creature on Earth, can be heard hundreds of miles away. These behemoths of the deep have adapted remarkably to life in the ocean's abyss. The immense pressure, the frigid temperatures, the lack of light, these conditions, inhospitable to most, are the very elements that have shaped these creatures into the titans they are today. But remember, our knowledge of these sea giants is only the tip of the iceberg. With most of the ocean still unexplored, who knows what other colossal creatures lurk in the Pacific's shadowy depths, waiting to be discovered. These giant creatures are a testament to the Pacific Ocean's incredible biodiversity and its many unsolved mysteries. In our journey through the Pacific Ocean, we have uncovered a world filled with mystery and intrigue. We've delved into the enigma of underwater pyramids, sailed through the treacherous waters of the Devil Sea and scrutinized the secrets of the islands that seemingly vanish and reappear. 
We've also encountered the awe-inspiring colossal creatures lurking in the ocean's dark depths. As we continue to explore this vast ocean, who knows what other mysteries we may uncover in the future?